Hi, I'm a stickler-ish. This short video shows how to adjust your electric brakes and to test your breakaway safety device. Although this is a 2021 Alio O2 travel trailer, you may find this video useful for other trailers as well. I know, there are already a multitude of good, detailed, and informative how-to videos on adjusting electric trailer brakes. I encourage you to review those as well. This video demonstrates performing a standard brake adjustment and breakaway system test specifically on an Alio. A lot of what you need to know about your Alio is in the 2022 Alio O-Series Owner's Manual available for download from the AlioVR.com website. The 2021 manual I have looks the same as the 2022. I don't know about the 2019 and the 2020 manuals, but alarmingly I found that the 2018 manual does not include quite a bit of information. Regarding brakes, per the Alio Owner's Manual, you should make sure the brakes work properly prior to every trip. Note that the Alio Owner's Manual makes no mention of testing the breakaway system. However, this should be considered part of making sure the brakes work properly prior to every trip. You should also adjust the brakes after the first 190 miles, 300 kilometers, since new. And you should adjust the brakes every three months or 2,800 miles or 4,500 kilometers thereafter. Let's get started. Adjusting the electric brakes on these small trailers is simple, but you still must be careful. It is more efficient to do this with both wheels off the ground, but you can certainly do this one side at a time. You will need wheel chocks, jack stands, something to lift and lower the trailer, and a brake spoon or flat blade screwdriver. The scissor jack in my Subaru Outback XT tow vehicle works well for me. Never lift or jack up your trailer using the stabilizers, and never place the jack or jack stands under the axle tube or the stabilizers. When lifting the first side, make sure you have the opposite wheel chalked. Lift and support the trailer using the doubled up frame beams directly forward and aft of the wheels. You only need to lift the trailer high enough for the wheels to spin freely. Be certain to use jack stands. As an extra safety precaution, I lower the tongue jack in my stabilizers after it's resting on the jack stands, but do not use tongue jack or stabilizer to lift the trailer. Brake adjustment is straightforward and adequately explained on page 34 of the 2022 Alio Owner's Manual, available for download from the AlioVR.com website. Under the trailer, looking outboard, remove the rubber plug from the adjusting slot on the brake backing plate. Using a screwdriver or brake spoon, rotate the star wheel to expand the brake shoes until the wheel is very difficult to turn. Then rotate the star wheel in the opposite direction until the wheel turns freely with a slight drag. Replace the rubber plug and repeat on the other side. Note, this is where having both wheels off the ground is efficient. Simply roll over and do the other side. And you can better dial in the drag of both wheels to be consistent. If a star wheel is too rusted or worn and does not turn, you will need to take the wheel and drum off to fix or replace the star wheel, and likely other brake components. Do not spray oil or brake free on the adjusting wheel through the adjusting slot. That will get oil on the interior machine brake surfaces. After adjusting both sides and before lowering the trailer, test the breakaway system. Note, the breakaway system is hardwired directly to the trailer battery. This test must be performed with the trailer disconnected from the tow vehicle and the battery disconnect switch in the off position. First, confirm both wheels spin freely. Next, firmly pull the breakaway pin straight out. You have just simulated a trailer breakaway. Make sure both wheels are firmly locked. Reinstall the breakaway pin, making sure it is firmly seated. Finally, make sure each wheel spins freely again. That's it. Happy travels and happy camping. Leave a comment if you have any questions or would like to share how you may have addressed these topics differently. Until next time, remember, read the manual.